Alright you guys, what is going on? Glitch here bringing you a brand new video today over another Pokemon Go mob bot version slash edit kind of deal for you guys. So anyways guys, let's get into the video. Um, this video is over Pokemon Bot, obviously. Um, and we will first show off the Discord, obviously. If you guys haven't joined the Discord, links in the description for that. And uh, you can find all your bot configs and more information about botting. And as well as proxies and manual sniping coordinates, etc. But let's get into the video, guys. Uh, it's a pretty cool little program. I think you guys will really like it. Um, so let me first pull up that. And then I'll show you guys what we're talking about here. So... I'll pull this up in a new tab, and there we go. So, you guys are probably like, what is that? That's weird. That doesn't make any sense. So, let's get into the video, guys. Obviously, links will be in the description for all the things you need to download. You'll want to download your Pokemon Bot, or you, and then, you know, run that. Set it up for the config file. Set up your auth file, etc. Once you have that set up, guys, and you're ready to run the bot, it shouldn't be too hard. Obviously, you edit your config. You can install proxies, etc. I'm not really going to go over config thing. If you're looking for a config, go to the video in the last, the last video that I made yesterday and you guys can download a good config file that's good for you guys and check it out but let's get into the video guys so once we have that download what you want to do is we'll close this here and we will grab this and we will go into our Poke East which is one of the things we're going to download it'll be the first I'll link in the description and the Pokemon bot will be the second once you get those downloaded you're going to go into your folder go to the SRC and look for index.html or the HTML file. What you're gonna do is simply grab this and drag this onto your web browser until you see a little arrow up there like you see on Chrome. Once you do that, it'll open up the page. And then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller for you guys. We're gonna head on back over to our Pokemon Bot and we're gonna run the PokemonBot.exe. What this will do is this will basically this just gives you an interface for what's going on here. So as you guys can see, Pokemon Bot's running right here, but this is showing you all the Pokestops and everything around it. So as you guys can see, it's gonna do some mapping, it'll pull up Pokemon as they're around. So let's see what happens. As you can see, you can pull up your journal, which is your incubator and things like that. When it's activated, Pokeballs, things you caught, times, etc. If you want to clear that, you can. Uh, hexagons are the gyms. And then it'll also show up these um, the Pokemon that are around. So then you guys can open up the menu. You can check out your Pokemon via the menu here. Check out your Pokedex, etc. What you have caught, what you haven't caught. Um, all those things. So, once you have that, Go to your backpack, and then you can also see all the items in your backpack. And yeah, guys, this is just a really nice interface for running a bot. It shows you kind of where you've been going with the arrows. This loads in. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer than others, but, you know, it works. And yeah, guys, just a cool little uh, another GUI kind of thing for the bot I thought you guys might like to see. I think it's really cool, uh, really creative, great idea. Honestly, it shows you so much information. Go to your journal, set up your configs, and just watch it go. And then you can go to your settings. There's not anything in here yet, but I think they're planning on adding things soon. But yeah, guys, I hope you like the video. I think it is pretty cool that it shows you all this. You can click this. shows attempts, probability, XP, candies, catch type, level, all that fun stuff that you guys might be curious about. And yeah, guys, I thought it'd just be a really cool little thing to show you guys. I thought it's awesome. It's another Pokemon bot kind of modification to make it look sweet, guys. So if you guys did enjoy the video, hit that like button. If you're new here and haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button for videos on Pokemon Go botting as they come out. And uh, if you really want to help your buddies out, go ahead and hit that share button, tweet at it, whatever you guys want to do. But I appreciate you guys so much for watching the video and hanging out. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.